Alright, uh, welcome back. This is Minyak. Today we'll be continuing the... Hmm... Well, continuing the... TOS character. So, this is... Go the epi This episode is going to be the Temporal Ambassador. Okay, this is part of the... Uh, let me see. Uh, yesterday's War. So, yeah, Temporal Ambassador. All right, let's we detected start. an anomaly in the Azure Nebula. Because of the Tholian activity in that area, we're concerned that they may be attempting to open a rift to the mirror universe. I need a ship to go out there and check it out. All right, before we start, uh, if you like this type of video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe, okay? So the Temporal Ambassador has a reward, actually a ship reward, a support cruiser, and a... Well, yesterday, Enterprise Uniform, so this is... Well, I think if I'm not mistaken, this is a Tier 4 cruiser. Anyway, okay, let's set. Okay. Alright, let's start Temporal Ambassador. Captain Starfleet Command report that a space-time anomaly has been seen in this area of space. With the Tholian activity in this region, they wanted us to check it out and see what we can learn. I have it on sensor. Sir, locking in coordinate now. Yeah. That was odd. It I'm no longer detecting anything in front of us, but I'm picking up similar or uh, possibly the same anomaly at new location. I, uh, I have updated the coordinate of the map. Okay, so... Uh, this is actually kind of like the one of the Star Trek episode. I forgot what which one was that. The one that actually... Where the Enterprise... Well, when was that? The alternate universe? I think it was TNG episode. So this is kind of similar. Okay, the anomaly is holding steady at its current location. Okay, scan the anomaly. Uh, Freighter Smorling requesting permission to dock at Atolian base. Alright. So suddenly there's, we are dragged into a different universe. Where my ship is not a cruiser, but actually a freighter ship. Okay, save or deny. Do you have a question? I'm back with the take a side ship. Thank you, Captain. The Tholian Assembly appreciates your loyalty. So many ship captains threw away their lives needlessly in the days after they annexed this area of space. It'll take a few hours to offload your cargo. Feel free to grab a hot meal in the commissary. I know that comforts can be hard to come by in this sector. I recommend the Plomeek soup. It almost tastes like something. Okay, thanks. Do you need anything else? All right. 
So you are thrown into an alternate universe. Uh, okay, scouring. No. Actually, ah, there's a Detan right here. Hello. Huh. Yeah, not part of the story though. This is alternate universe. Get some food in the mess hall. Humanite dietary supplement 47. I haven't seen you around here before, Captain. Okay, Richard Castile. Got a minute to talk? Okay, I'm new here. I know. I asked around about you, and I don't know if I'm supposed to be telling you this, but I need your help. You're not supposed to be here. None of us are. Not in this timeline, I mean. My ship, my crew. We were supposed to do something important. We went through an anomaly, moved through time, and everything changed. Hey, continue. We tried to go back. I guess the battle with the Klingons disrupted the anomaly. Instead of getting back where we belong. We ended up here, with Atholians running everything. I'd never even seen Atholian before. You have to help us set things right. You have to help us get back to our ship. What are you talking about? Who is us? Me and my crew. There are a little over a hundred of us here, scattered throughout the work camp. We're about 65 years ahead of where we should be, according to my math. We were fighting the Romulans. This was back in 2344. And the weapons discharges caused a temporal rift. We passed through, and because we weren't at Narendra to do what we were supposed to do, the timeline changed. We ended up in a timeline where the Federation and the Klingon Empire were at war, and the Federation was losing, badly. We tried to go back to set things right, but then the Klingons found us in the Enterprise D, and there's someone here with us from that timeline. Her name is Tasha. I'll take you to her. Maybe she can help explain. Okay, lead on. Uh, uh, sorry about the background noises, city things. <laughs> if you live in the city, all right. Talk to Asha. We need your help. Okay, what's going on here? I'm from Starfleet, and if I'm right, that's a name that should ring bells with you as well. In an alternate timeline from this one, the correct one, Starfleet is still alive and well, and you're a Starfleet officer too. When the Enterprise C moved ahead in time, it created an alternate timeline, one in which I was alive but shouldn't have been. I left with the Enterprise to set things right. Continue. We thought we were returning to the Narendra system in 2344 to defend the Klingon colony there from a Romulan attack. We ended up in this nebula in 2409. The Tholians caught us before we could try again and... You can guess the rest. We're going to try to restore the timeline, but to do so, we need the Enterprise C. It's still in the hangar here, and as soon as we get back to her, We'll find the temporal rift and get back to where and when we're supposed to be. To do that, we need your help. Okay, count me in. What do you need me to do? Franklin Drake is already helping us. He managed to get an access key used to operate the systems in the hangar control room. We need you to get the code from Drake and use it to open the doors to the hangar control room. <sighs> I'd go myself. But we've already been here a week. The Tholians know we're trying to get back to the ship. They're watching us. But you're new. They won't suspect you're involved. That's the idea, at least. Of course, it's not as simple as getting the code and opening the door. The Tholians have guards on all critical areas. You'll need to slip past the guards and get into the maintenance tunnels. From there, it's a winding maze to the hangar control room, which can only be unlocked from the inside. Once you get in, 
you'll be able to open the doors. We'll be waiting there to help you free the Enterprise. Okay, I will do it. What's next? Here, take this communicator. It's on a scrambled frequency the Tholians don't monitor, and it'll allow me to contact you while you're on the move. Maybe you can convince someone to cause a distraction. That might make slipping past the guards into the tunnels easier. Okay, thanks. Get a key from Franklin Drake. Yar and Castile uh, said you have a key for me. Take it. Here's a map too. You'll need it in the tunnels. I still don't know why I'm risking my neck for this. Don't expect any more help from me. The Federation fell before I was born. I shouldn't even care, but there's something about Yar and Castillo. I know they believe they can make a difference. It makes me want to believe. Thank you, I'll take the risk now. Do you need anything else? Nothing else. Can someone to create a diversion? Uh, Shan is probably. Because this is a Starfleet character. Shan probably is the one that can actually create the diversion. How can I assist you? Can I get you to create the uh, diversion for us? We need to reach the control room. I don't remember the Federation or Starfleet. The war was almost over before I was born. This is the only life I know. One of servitude, deprivation, loss. I want something better. That freedom my parents and grandparents told me about. I want the Federation back. I'll help. Just tell me what you need. Thanks. Yeah, if you have different character, for example Romulan, then Sean will not help you. And if you have Klingon, yeah, Sean will not help you either. It will be something along the line of your own faction character. Ah, uh, there's a Jara. Jara right here. You cannot win, Tholian! Three, go in. Enter maintenance tunnel. Okay, few hand-drawn map. Yep. That's it. Okay, uh, go right here, maybe. Actually, I forgot. Makes sense. Okay, consult the wisest Tribble, right? Hello, Tribble, please share your wisdom. Okay, roll down, gentle door food, realize you are talking to a Tribble. Maybe you have been in this access tunnel for too long. Or maybe it's the gas fumes. <laughs> uh, the up again.
Okay. Uh, let's go right north. If I'm not mistaken, there is supposed to be a body here. Yep, right here. He is dead, Jim. <laughs> Who is Jim? It's just for accolade. Then you, you go down south, right here, go down south. So it's like a S letter. Plus gas fan. Okay, fan control room atmosphere. Oxygen base atmosphere. A drone map. We're going south. Lower ambient temperature. Okay, now... So the map looks like this. It is going to be like this all the time, so yeah. Might as well remember it. Search crate... Level appropriate item. Hey, uh, this is for accolade. I am just... Going through accolade stuff. Yeah, so there's something here, there's something here, there's also something here on the dead end. Pretty much on the, all the dead, dead end, there's something. Well, for accolade purposes. Now, this is it. We have reached the end. I've engaged the security lockouts. That will buy us a little time. Yeah. I still. We need to work together. What do you want me to do? Specialty. I was the helm officer on the Enterprise before everything went to hell. But I'm really handy with heavy machinery, like those clamps holding the ship. And I know I can take care of that. We need to yeah. work together. So, tell him what to. What do you want me to do? Docking clamps. I am here to assist. What do you equal? My first posting in Starfleet was to an ambassador class vessel. I am familiar with most of the ship's systems, but I spent several months working on a refit of the ship's computer. I am here to assist. What do you require? A ship portal level. We don't have much time. I know a few tricks to take that tractor. We don't have much time. Oh, Tasha is tractor beam. Well, I'm actually accessing the web emitter. Stabilize energy. It doesn't really matter which which one you choose. They can actually do it all, all of them. Overriding security protocols. The only difference is the speed. Their uh, speed progress on the if you actually um what do you call assign the uh, character to uh, the field they are not specialized for it will take longer but it will still come. I'm changing the targeting <laughs> subroutines for the tractor beams. Oh uh, yeah, it doesn't really matter which one you assign them for.
tractor beam is disabled. Back to ship. I thought you deactivated all the security protocols. Or force field. Do you want me to do that for you? I know a few things about force fields. Having trouble? You do know that we could have Tholians swarming us any minute, right? I thought we took care of everything. Starfleet Protocol 547C clearly states. I don't think the Tholians have heard of Protocol 547C. Okay. So we are running away with Enterprise C. I'm detecting Tholian mesh weavers headed for our position. Tholian orb weavers on an intercept. Tholian recluses moving into weapons range. I recommend some basic action. Nowhere and destroyed that Tholian tarantula. I've never seen a ship of that configuration before. Or what is that kind of? Looks like you could use some help. We took a hit. Basils are partially offline. We'll need to work together to take out this last ship. is clear and the temporal anomaly has been stabilized head for the anomaly enterprise it will put you back where you need to be okay who are you how do you know where we are where we need to be that's my job the details aren't important restoring the timeline is get moving 
The Tholians are already starting to regroup. Okay, thanks for your help setting course now. Just setting course after I grab some credit. Okay. Where is the location of the... Okay. Okay, let's go to the... Sh go back to in time. Restore timeline. Okay, fly through temporal anomaly. Where am I? Okay. What am I doing here? Hmm. I'm sure you've realized by now. You're part of a very different timeline. This one is an aberration that we are here to correct. It would be irresponsible of us to let you go back in time with the Enterprise C and compromise that timeline as well. What are you going to do with me then? We'll send you back to your time. There are still some very important events in the 25th century that you need to be a part of. So how do I get back? As soon as the Enterprise C returns to its correct place in history, the timeline should right itself. Okay, so we are back where we started. Scanning the anomaly. That is strange, sir. I thought I had something on sensor, but it's gone. Everything is quiet, no tolerance, no or other ship in within range. And the anomaly Starfleet Command wanted us to investigate isn't here either. We can depart uh, the system on your order, sir. Temporal mess. Hell. There wasn't anything? That is strange. Okay, so you will get this. Well, and when you complete this for the first time, you will get special requisition pack, support cruiser, ambassador class. So this is the Enterprise C, the one that you have been using. Right here. We've detected significant temporal activity in the Galorndon core system, circa the 23rd century. I'm going to investigate it, and I'd like you to join me. We believe the Nakul are involved, along with a planet killer. A doomsday machine. If so, we need to stop them at all costs. I'll provide your ship with holographic camouflage. It's best if the Romulans of that time don't see a vessel from the future. All right, uh, so the next episode will be the core of the matter, okay? Stay safe out there. All right, that's the end for Temporal Ambassador. You actually get the ship. This ship right here. Well, this is not exactly a tier 5 uh, cruiser, but this is a, I think it's a tier 4 cruiser, something like that. But yeah, but you can still use it. And this is... Uh, the, it has the exact model of the Enterprise, well, Enterprise C. Okay. Alright, uh, this is the end of the video for Temporal Ambassador. I will see you guys on the next episode, the core that matter. Okay, uh, thank you for watching. I will see you guys uh, next time on the next video, alright? Uh, this is Minyak signing off.